guys, subscribers and viewers, I want to welcome you back to this wonderful channel. Welcome back to Awubi channel. Those who have not subscribed to my channel yet, please kindly do so because I have more to offer. Um, in this video, we are going to talk about the border gateway protocol, which is found in most advanced routers. And this is a routing protocol, just like we know of about OSPF, RIP, and the rest. So um, let me give a, a little bit explanation about this BGP or border gateway protocol. It works like a postal service of the internet. When someone drops a letter into a mailbox, the postal service processes that piece of mail and chooses a fast, efficient route to deliver the letter to its recipient. Similarly, when someone submits data via the internet, the Border Gateway Protocol or BGP is responsible for looking at all of the available paths that data could travel and picking the best route which usually means hopping between autonomous systems. Okay, BGP is the protocol that makes the internet work by enabling data routing. When a user is in like Singapore, loads a website with origin servers in Argentina, BGP is a protocol that enables that communication to happen quickly and efficiently. So kindly stay tuned whilst we go through the configuration I did earlier on BGP. Okay, so kindly stay tuned and please don't forget to subscribe again, watch my videos and share my videos. Thank you. So without wasting time, let's go ahead with this configuration. Um, you can locate the BGP or Border Gateway Protocol under Routing. So we are dealing with two routers. The first router is at my left and the other one at my right. And so let's deal with the first configuration on the first router. And so I've given it a name which is Remote Routing. Um, yeah, let me just give it Routing. Yes and then change the AS number, which is autonomous system, to the number I just specified here, and then put in the router ID of the remote. Um, okay, so I'm just putting the, the same router ID of the router I'm on. Then you go to new BGPPM, you can specify a name here or leave it at default and then put in the remote IP which is the router I've opened at my right side and then you assign the remote AS number in this case it is peer-to-peer -peer which I'm configuring so I need to put in the same AS numbers and so I've configured the first one now let me move on to the second one. I need to do the same thing I did on the first router. By to get to a point when I get to the router ID, I will put in um, the same router I'm on. So this is the IP for the same router I'm on. Applying OK. And then you go to pair. And then you add can give it a name and then you add the remote address which is the router at my left okay mind you these are public IPs I'm assigning so you further go ahead and assign the same remote AS number and that that is it it should start working unless I've not done something right and so let me look through and make sure I've done something right here I think the issue has got to do with the instance. I need to change the instance instances to 
the one I just configured and gave it a name, routing. That is what I'm supposed to do. So I'll quickly do that correction. And then you notice that there will be a connection established between these two networks. So at this point, I need to change the instance and then there will be a connection established. Okay, bingo. So there is a, a connection between these two networks and it's working perfectly. If we look at the status, it, they are, they've, been, they've both been connected to each other and they are working perfectly. Okay, so this is a basic configuration of the BGB protocol in Microtech. This is basically how you can go about it and I don't think it will take a whole lot a whole hell of time for you to figure this out. Okay. So for now let's do a couple of tests between these routers and then see um, if we can get to each other. trying to ping a particular IP but I guess it's not active so I'm not able to reach it all right we've come to the end of this video thank you for staying tuned and please I need your subscriptions share my videos like my videos and your comments are expected as well thank you and we'll meet again